They say they pop. If you like your Jim Beam booze, you might cry while I'm telling you this story. A warehouse burned up. It's still fucking burning. And we're talking 45,000 barrels of bourbon burning. Now, Jim Beam says, hey, that's only 1% of our supply. So don't worry, you fucking alcoholics. We got more. They want you to know that. <laughs> but this fire was so fucking hot that they said parts of the fire trucks were melting. And they don't want to just put out the fire because if they pour water all over it, it'll end up running even more into the streams. This happened in Versailles, Kentucky. And already they say that they see bourbon all in the river, the Kentucky River, and in Glens Creek nearby. So you know the environmentalists are out there, they're testing and everything, and they said the oxygen levels are real low, so a lot of fish are going to unfortunately die. So right now they're letting the bourbon barrels, I'm sorry, I just like saying bourbon barrels. They're letting the fucking bourbon barrels burn because they think this thing is eventually going to burn itself out. And that's a lot safer than them applying water all over the place and, the, you know, the water droplets carrying more poisons outside of the contained area that it's already in. As well as the water just running off to nearby land and into creeks and the river. Which it's already done to an extent, but it'll be even worse if they start doing that. But this is a very hot fire. I mean, it's one of the worst things that could have caught on fire. An alcohol warehouse? I mean, it's just full of bottles of fucking fuel. I mean, there's a few things I can think of that would be worse, but this is up there. This is pretty high up there. Shit you don't want to catch on fire. They think lightning might have started this. They can't get in yet to test and check everything out real carefully and figure out how the fuck this thing started. So this stuff was basically just sitting in there aging. That's what they do with bourbon. They age it. That's where it gets that dark color over time. That's when it starts tasting good. And that's when it starts getting that color. It just caught on fire and now it's like this fucking monster. It's like these huge tall flames. It looks like a huge barbecue. If nearly 50,000 barrels is only 1% of their inventory, that means they have almost 5 million barrels of bourbon. Jesus!